Hello friends, today we are going to find the zeros of the polynomial 4 root 3x square plus 5x minus 2 root 3 and x square plus 2 root 2x minus 6. Actually, I had selected this question because generally all students are having doubt when sir, root or irrational numbers are there in this type of questions. What we have to do? Generally, what we were doing in simple question, that only we have to do it here. Look here, I am solving. 4 root 3 x square plus 5 x minus 2 root 3. How we were doing the splitting the middle term when in simple sum that way only. First we have to multiply the coefficient of x square and the last to c means a and c that will be 4 into 2 8 minus 8 and 3 into 3 so root 3 into root 3 3 so minus 24 will be done. Now we have to find out the factor whose multiplication will be minus 24 and addition will be the coefficient of or you can say b only b or coefficient of x that is plus 5. So what will be the factors 8 3 is a 24 and 8 minus 3 that will be 5. So 8 into minus 3 that will become minus 24 8 plus minus 3 that will become positive or plus 5. Now directly find out keep the instead of 5 split the middle term as plus 8x minus 3x and then again minus 2 root 3. Now we have to find out the common from this two number it's so simple 4 and it's 4 to the so 4 and again x also common so root 3x plus and here will be 2. Now take out common from these two numbers. Minus is there so first we will take out minus because we want to convert this plus is was here so here also we want plus. But here it's 3 and root 3. So the factors of 3 is actually root 3 into root 3 and here also one root 3 is here. So you can take out root 3 also common. Now from this 1 root 3 is gone so 1 root 3 will be remaining in x and then this minus we had taken out common so plus 2. Now you can see both the factors are same root 3x plus 2 and the other is 4x minus root 2. Now these two are the factors we want 0 so equal to 0 so here root 3x plus 2 is equal to 0 so root 3x is equal to minus 2 x is equal to minus 2 by root 3 this will be your first 0 and here this will be 4x minus root 3 is equal to 0 4x is equal to root 3 and x is equal to root 3 by 4 so these are the two zero now for this sum x square minus plus 2 root 2x minus 6 so here 1 into minus 6 minus 6 so what we have to we have to find out the factors of minus 6 so that multiplication will be minus 6 but addition will be the middle number that is 2 root now the problem arises now we have to find out the factors of 6 first we know factors of 6 will be 3 and 2 3 multiply with 2 but we want 2 root 2 so root 2 is there so again we have to find out the factors of root 2 that will be root 2 into root 2 and this 3 now you can add or subtract how 3 into root 2 means you can make one pair of this and now plus 3 into root 2 means 3 root 2 and minus root 2 yes 3 into root 2 multiply with minus root 2 what will happen minus 6 and 3 into root 2 plus minus root 2 subtraction 3 minus 1 will become 2 root 2 yes so we got the factors I am writing it here x square plus 2 sorry 3 root 2 x minus root 2 x minus 6 now common from this 2 x common x plus 3 root 2 now first we want to take out minus common because we here plus was there so we have to change the sign. Now we have to take out root 2 also. Look here the factors of 6 are 3 into root 2 into root 2. And so we can take out 1 root 2 common from this. 
so root 2 also common here root 2 we have taken out common so x and here out of this 6 only 1 this root 2 gone so what will be the remaining number plus 3 root now what will be our factors x plus 3 root 2 and x minus root so x plus 3 root 2 is equal to 0 so x will be equal to minus 3 root 2 and here x will be equal to only plus root 2. Thank you so much for watching my video. If you like it, please subscribe to my channel so that I can bring more such videos for you. Thank you so much.